In this video, I'll show you how easy it is to replace a leaking supply line. Start by clearing the work area as necessary to perform the task. It's a good idea to spread a towel to catch any water that may drip. Determine where the leak is coming from by using your hand and feeling for moisture around the joints. It's a good idea to start at the top and work your way down. Also keep a dry towel handy so that you may determine exactly where the leak is coming from by keeping your hands dry. My problem is at the top of the cold water supply line. I'm going to replace this line with a new line. I'll begin by shutting off the water to the line. The top of the line has a toolless fitting, but yours may not. These are the tools I'll be using. I'll loosen the bottom supply line from the valve with a wrench, just enough so that I can continue to remove it with my fingers. Now I can remove the line. The water trapped in the line will escape. I'll be replacing the old line with a new braided line. This line has a rubber grommet at each end, so it does not require thread tape, but it won't hurt to leave the old thread tape on the threads. I'll hand tighten the top, then the bottom. Using a wrench, tighten the nuts just enough so that the rubber grommet has firm contact with the valve. Over tightening is not necessary because the rubber grommet will prevent it from leaking. Thoroughly dry the area so that any leaks may be detected. Turn on the supply valve and then turn on the faucet valve. This will remove any air in the line. Some residue from the line is normal and should clear up in a few seconds. Inspect the line for leaks. If the line is leaking at the connection point, try tightening the nut just a little more. If no leak is detected, wait 15 minutes and recheck. If all is clear, get things back in order and it's time to kick back and relax. If you found this video informative and or enjoyable, please hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. God bless. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.